my gosh, these pants just fit great on me. <laughs> I'm trying to find a word to describe myself without being disrespectful. Fred, can I have one night of you being quiet, please? Just one night? Oh my gosh, Mom. Talk to Hank, because my face is not going to put up with that. Hey, guys. I'm sorry you had to put up with that. I don't even know why my mom's acting all crazy. I'm just practicing for the dance tonight. Yes, you heard right. My school's having its annual Valentine's Day dance tonight. I am so ready for this dance. I even wore my best cocky pants. That's right. These are my cockies, and my ankles might be short, but that is just okay with me. I'm especially excited for the dance because I'm going to dance really hardcore with Judy. I'm going to be dancing like this the whole entire night. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Break down to the move, break down to the move. Down to the beat, get down to the beat, get down to the beat. My bad. Let's just hope that doesn't happen at the dance. And the most fantastical thing about this dance is, it's about Kevin. He won't be able to dance really long because it's going to get really hot and sweaty and his armpits is going to get all stainy. And yeah, he won't be able to dance very long because he's really fat. Yeah, nobody really wants to dance with a fat, sweaty guy. Yeah, trust me. My mom told me all about it. Like, I mean, I'm not trying to offend any of you, but my mom tells me girls are not attracted to sweaty guys. I mean, if you're fat and sweaty, I can't help you with that. Maybe the doctor can give you medicine for that. I can't help you. I'm sorry. Huh, now that my hair's all sexy, I'm going to spray some sexy air postal on me. And now uh, all the girls are going to be all, all, all over me. It's, they're all going to want to dance with the Fred Master. Yeah. Okay, so Mr. Minotaur is going to hit the dance floor. I'll see you guys all later. I'm never going to that. I'm never going to that school ever again. Ah, oh, they made me so upset I pee on myself. Ah, I'm gonna change into my other pants because my pants smell like urine. No, no chewing on pants that I peed on. I know, I know. You didn't know better. It's okay. <laughs> but anyways, the pants didn't go as I planned because Judy was dancing with that fat slob all night, and he was sweaty, and she was still dancing with him. I'm not even exaggerating, but the dancing was sick. It was sick. And I wouldn't even be surprised if Judy was pregnant tomorrow because of dancing like that. It was so disgusting, it was like she was in a 50 dance video. You know, it was like when she was dancing in a rap video or something. Well, I guess I can't focus on all the negative things all the time, even though I was dancing at the corner all by myself most of the time. I did dance with one person. Okay, so I was dancing by myself in the corner, and this one girl came up to me with a whole bunch of acne covering her face, and she asked me to dance. I mean, once I got past the fact that her face was covered with acne, it was pretty fun. We danced to single ladies, and we knew to dance perfectly, so it was really fun. Even though the other kids were all laughing at us and taking pictures on my phones. But I didn't care. If I had a chance, I would teach every single one of those kids in my school a thing or two. Then maybe they'll accept me. I mean, seriously, those kids in my school should be happy that I'm there. I bring a lot to the table. I know the single ladies dance, I'm a good singer, and sometimes I bring stray animals to school. So they should be happy. Okay, well, the dance was pretty fun, even though it would have been nice if Judy would have noticed me. But I'm gonna go. Okay, bye guys.